Prototype IT will be enabling two-factor authentication for Office 365 to ensure the utmost security for our customers. Two-factor authentication will add an extra layer of security to the login process that will help prevent unauthorized access to your accounts. To set up two-step verification, please follow these steps. First, sign in to your Office 365 account with your username and password like you normally do. Once you click Sign In, you will be brought to a page stating your organization needs more information to keep your account secure. Once you are here, click on the Next button to go to the Additional Security Verification page. You will now be prompted to select the authentication method you want to use. Prototype IT recommends the Authenticator app for easiest access. This method has you download and install an Authenticator app on your cell phone that will generate a six-digit code to use when signing into your Office 365 account. Other methods include text, which has six-digit codes sent to a phone number via SMS, and phone call, where Microsoft calls you with an automated message to confirm your identity when signing into OWA. In this video, we will be focusing on the Authenticator app. To set up the Authenticator app, first choose the Mobile App option from the drop-down underneath Step 1. Then choose Use Verification Code. Now click the Setup button. You will now be taken to the Configure Mobile App page. First, download and install the Microsoft Authenticator app on your phone from the Microsoft Store, Google Play, or Apple Store. Once you have installed the app on your phone, open it up, add an account, and choose Work or School Account. Now use the app to scan the QR code on your computer screen. Your phone app should now display a six-digit code. If so, go back to your computer and click the Next button on the Configure Mobile App page. If everything goes correctly, you should be taken back to the Additional Security Verification page with a confirmation message saying the mobile app has been configured for notifications and verification codes. Click the Next button and you will be brought to Step 2, which will ask for the six-digit code from your phone app. Once you've entered in the code, you will then be asked for alternate contact information in case you ever lose your phone with the Authenticator app. Next, you will set up your app password, if applicable. If you use a native phone app, such as iPhone Mail app, Gmail app, or an email application or service that does not support 2FA, then you will need to generate an app password that you will use in place of your normal password. To create your app password, copy and paste the link provided in a new tab. You will be asked to enter in a code from your Authenticator app a second time. Once you are on the App Passwords page, click Create. Enter in the name of the password, not the password itself, to help you know where it will be used to log in. Once you have finished naming your app password, the password itself will be displayed with the option to copy it to your clipboard. Please note, this password will only be displayed once, so be sure to store it in a safe location. When you are finished, you can use that app password instead of your regular email password to log in to your iPhone mail app or email application that does not support 2FA. If you ever need to create another app password for another application, you can always go back to this page and create one. If you need further help regarding two-factor authentication, please call us at 214-270-0850 or visit us at www.prototypeit.net forward slash support.